So, super funny coincidence, uh, I'm going to put this before the start of the video game because uh, my dumbass did not pay attention, and that's fine. So, uh, before we get to the game, I, at the end of it, I mentioned how, hey, uh, we'll check out the Council of Hanwell, because I thought this was an actual sequel to Welcome to Hanwell, but I, I happened to see on Welcome to Hanwell when I was uninstalling it, how Beyond Hanwell, the sequel to Welcome. I was like, well, what the fuck is the council? And then I came to the council, it's all mixed. I was like, okay, whatever. And then I made comments about like, it would be nice to have a better, like get rid of the open world, have a more catering thing. So I'm not, I'm not re-editing, I'm not re-recording. Like, welcome to Hanwell is going to stand as is. I'm just putting this before because um, this council is a concentrated horror experience featuring all the locations. So he did make a version and he kind of cleaned it up a little bit. The visuals are better. Um, he did make a version that took out the open world stuff. Now I'm going to cut around the open world stuff anyways, but I can't, I, I have to comment on it. Um, this is, this is it again. The game still plays and functions the way and it's still, I think it has the storytelling beats, like all the different, all the recorders. So nothing like super, it's not like a revamp, uh, like a complete remake of welcome to Hanwell that really caters to a more linear experience, but he did happen to make this. So I'm not actually going to play this. Like I say at the end of the video, cause I say, I'll see you in uh, the council. Um, just ignore that. Um, uh, but yeah, I'm going to put this at the front because uh, turns out this is the more linear version of the game that just takes you through the places. Because I was looking at the screenshots and I was like, this just looks like the game. And that's pretty much because it is. And there's a few things. Uh, so you play through the major locations, story driven. There are extra game modes, which I'm not going to mess with. And then a graphic overhaul. Welcome to Handwell is the initial one. Then he did Council seemingly and took out the whole open world thing and, and revamped the graphics. Uh, but I still played uh, Welcome to Handwell. So just not going to play the Council. Uh, uh, watch me as I go through Welcome to Hanwell. I'm going to chop it up a bit. And then uh, instead of the council, we'll go right into uh, well uh, Beyond Hanwell teaser. Yo, what up? <clears throat> we're going we're gonna to check out Hanwell. A few people have played this before. I'm going to give it a whirl. Um, it'll probably be chopped up because I tested this game. Um, it's also, I can't grab the camera but it's making my entire razor keyboard, mouse pad, mouse. Is it affecting the, no, that's normal. I have it set to like shift slowly through colors in I think accordance with, actually it's not in sync, no. I thought it was like with this flickering light that I'm looking at, but I don't think that's the case. So I'm also checking this out because they uh, released a Beyond Handwell. So um, it'll be three parts. I thought about clumping it all into one, but we'll go ahead and have Handwell as its own. And then we'll do Council as its own, and then we'll do the teaser. Let's say without. <clears throat> yeah, it's still flickering. It's not in sync with anything. It's just the gate. It's. The mysterious Jogo. So apparently we start out. Somebody tried. No, wait. Is that just a body? That's not a uh, furnace, right? That's just a, um, actually, I don't, I don't even know the proper, proper name or term, but like where you just put the body. I don't know what's wrong. Okay. It's fine. What we got, we got crouches. We got runsies. Spooky. Oh, hello. I used a combination of anabolic steroids and insulin to initiate the subject. He exhibited an intense reaction to the drugs. Rapid muscle growth was observed, but a hormone imbalance has developed, causing extreme uncontrollable... Come on. Rage. Well, that's just your a fault. A dose of clozapine seems to keep him under control. Fucking idiot. Like, yeah, you can easily overdo anabolic steroids. Why would you give him a mass dose? Anyways, I had a thought. Oh, so this, this 
game has somewhat of an uh oh an open exploration we're not we're not we're just not gonna we're not fucking with that um uh i'm not gonna say we're gonna try to get through this as quickly as possible but i'm not i'm not going through every fucking house you know certain horror experiences it's okay if they're linear you know what i'm saying you don't need like i i don't i don't know what the thought process is a good linear experience is nice it, it's good you don't n need your players wandering in an open world why okay when there's not really that much and you're trying to fill it with maybe story that's what i get like i could i could see that right you're trying to fill it with stories so you go through houses you find all this different so maybe like we'll fuck around and and like check out some of the how uh places but i see minkies I see more blinkies. what the fuck happened in here well, somebody had to put a light in here to highlight it <laughs> yo check this shit out i've had to look away b6 his anger is getting more intense with each observation he managed to tear off the door to his room i've Damn. had to put him behind bars no padding the damage he does to himself barely has an effect anyway. Oh, is this... Is that him just... Is he just roid raging all over the place? If anybody's listening, if anybody is listening to this message, you might... The fuck happened to her? Sounds like a good old neck snap. Research notes of 10.07. 2021. Yeah, 2021. The jail rejected my request for another inmate, citing morality as a reason. The mayor has taken the same stance. They told me the only people they are currently holding haven't had a trial, that I might as well just snatch someone from the streets. That's, that's a bad time. I wouldn't do that. Oh yeah. Oh Jesus. That's that's a that's a good fucking time right there. God damn savage bit me. He's lost almost all real cognitive function. Oh. That's actually proximity somewhat. Hold on, that's my bad. Also, <laughs> not really, uh, what's a good term? Leaving story bits <laughs> throughout a place that nobody would actually appropriately put in real life. Like, this is where it's like, all right, somebody, so, somebody is making a game. Like, oh, sweet. Uh, use flashlights when it's too dark. Are using flashlight will lead it to malfunction. It may cause it to break completely. That's bullshit. Something changed. Oh, shit. Oh, that that's the roid razor. Excuse me, sir. Sir, please. I have nothing to bite. I'm I'm all but I'm all I'm mainly meat. I'm very viscous. <laughs> Didn't I have to crouch when I came through here? Did I did I lose him? I don't want to look behind. It, ta it takes too long to look behind. The music stopped. Leaving. I'm leaving. Ooh. The music's back. The music's back. Please open the gate. Oh, it's so cinematic. Oh, no. It's, it's okay. I'm leaving. This is... I think we're fine. Mr. Royds. If 
uh, I, I can get you more steroids, sir. I got the hookup. That's a nice tense moment. That's not bad. Is there? Some serious cracks in the ce in the ceiling. They're they're so fine that all the individual rain droplets make it through perfectly. Oh shit! There is combat. Attack left, black or right. Be sure to keep moving. Draw your move. Park, park. How do I? I put away the weapon. Do, oh no! Oh, wait. He just drops it. That's fine. On the radio. So the cue the radio emits continues to play back from the surrounding. You will emit static when anomalies are nearby. Some anomalies. Who the fuck put me in there? Why am I woke? Creeping. She's creeping. Where is she? Man, I got a pretty good draw distance. Where the fuck is it? I'm scared. Come on, please come pick me up. The music is out of control. Oh, there it is. There. Bring it on. Come here. Oh, no. Oh, it's the screaming girl I got from my, company, my thumbnail. Let me look. Woo. Where is it? I win. Mm. <laughs> what happened? Hold on. <laughs> Where'd she go? Yo. Beat the brakes off that muscle. <laughs> Slap the shit out of her. What happened? That's the best. Oh, that's the best. I keep pressing. Is it? <sighs> Slap the shit out that bitch. No nice sonata, anyone? No. Turn here when you've collected all 100 doctor DNA. Oh, Jesus. Got a phone? Hello? I've just got word that you've authorized the arrest of Isabel Miller. I'm going to need a copy of the arrest warrant you've signed. A few of our residents who are familiar with your work have expressed concerns that you may be abusing the authority I have given you. Okay. Yo, get some rest, girl. Is there more down here already? The fuck, the gas eyeballs! The fuck was that? I'm not going in there. Fuck you. Can't make me. Found some Coca Cola. This is bullshit. Yes, anomalies are in my area. I think a uh, large eyeball would count as an anomaly. Oh, to see clearly, I left the mayor's letter and our final piece of the Miller's card in the safe. I won't be able to get it to her, so you may have to. If you get the code, just remember it's always an X. Oh, we got puzzles. Get, put it down. Daniel, I'm growing concerned with the doctor's actions. I know you work closely with him, but I'm also certain of your loyalty to our residents. Keep me posted on his latest research, will you? Although, you know, it does take a lot of work to... Well, here's the thing. <laughs> if you build a huge map, could you have actually put more time into making an area's living... A uh, house's, like, living space more realistic, right? Because, like, why is that on the floor over there? What the fuck is this doing here? Well, but that, I can't tell if you're... That, I think that's a windowed out. No, it's a serious reflection. I don't know. 
Gonna save. Daniel, I am currently at the council building and will remain here for the foreseeable future. I cannot stress enough how important it is that you remain inside my home. Keep the doors down and prepare for all types of anomaly. I promise your loyalty to the cause will be rewarded. And it starts tonight. Man, anytime somebody starts talking about loyalty to a cause. All right, his bell motors, car holder herself, jail. Oh, card holders. Uh, jail, church, hospital, power plant, school. I have one piece left for the mayor. Miller was the only class one citizen in zone three. Without her card, nobody can, have, can access the council building. Oh. No, I can't. Get your fucking head out of the way. Get your head shadow. I'm trying. I'm really trying. There's no way to. That's stupid. Here. Can you pick it up like a fucking normal person? There you go. <laughs> All right. We got. Oh, shit. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. It's always. One, three, four, two. So one, three, seven, nine. Or one, two, three, four. So one, one, nine, three, seven. Hey, nice. Let's go. Let's go. Here's a piece of Isabel Miller's citizenship card. You make it as a reminder of what will happen to you should you oppose me. I split the card into six pieces and distributed them amongst the Hanwell's most prominent citizens. You're the last. Hanwell belongs to me. It's the doctor. The fuck? The church has been added to my map. I didn't know I had a map. Mod is not available indoors. That's why. All right. Shitting me? Oh man! Hey! Took my axe. Where'd the pipe go? Just stupid. It's fine. I got a map now. All right, there's the church. Piece of Isabel is known to be in the church. Huh? Yeah. All right. So. I was aware of this. Look at all this fucking shit. Free to explore and do as you please. There are six pieces of visible information across Hanwell. You must find them to gain access to the council. One is known to be at the church. This would be a good place to start, but it's your choice. Like, look at the kind of effort put into the size of this fucking map. Holy shit. Now, I could also easily look up a guide. If I want to see the, if, it, depending on the ending, right? Let's just go for the cards. <laughs> and if they're... And then I might just look up a map, right? Oh my god, this is so fucking big. And here's the problem. If it's empty, right? Like, how many monsters? I guess it's... You know what? My bad. I guess it's no different than, like, Silent Hill, right? But depending on how empty it feels, that's gonna be a huge issue. Alright, where's this fucking church? No. Oh, that's a save. I'm at a payphone trying to call. Okay, music, calm down. This music is out of control. Oh, okay. I can't enter everywhere. That, man. I, that's what I was worried about. Walk up to every door and it's like, would you like to enter? Would you like to enter? Would you like to enter? And like, no, I would not. Okay, we made it to the church. And it would seem that the map actually shows you where the DNAs are. Huh. Okay, so that's not the worst. Maybe more progresses, because they're, like, I encountered nothing on my way here. All right. More cards. Yeah, and that is another thing. The whole, like, <laughs> a lot of indie games doing this whole collect bullshit is always a... Uh, is always a... That's not even a love-hate relationship. That's just kind of a hate-hate relationship. It's like, hey, again, how do you pad time in your game or make people feel like they're doing more? Uh, put things around for them to collect. So, am I also saying... Yeah, if there's no weapon, then, like, there's no threat either. 
Thomas, I don't know what you've been doing recently, but there's lots of noise about your church. We're getting calls every day about your state of mind. Now, while I understand the importance of faith in today's world, you must keep in mind that problems in Hanwell, well, they cannot be solved by superstitious rituals. Cheers. Just leave it to the doctor. God, you're lucky that we're friends. Anyone else would have locked you in the ward by now. Although the doctor's also insane. Everybody here's insane, of course. Never move to a small town. Thanks for agreeing to help out with the ritual. Today's hymns are extremely important. Be sure to keep a note of them before they're changed. And never forget, a painting is worth a thousand words. Let's see paintings here. Nice, nice. Oh, shit. Uh, keep an eye on today's hymns. Okay. Maybe, okay, so we got, uh, they're not exact, so we have a six and a six. A two, nine, nine. Maybe it's the empty. Well, yeah, because they're not exactly the same, because six, that one has a seven over there. Well, let's just try that first, so the empty one. So we got five, two, nine, three, maybe? Assuming it's just a four digit, right? Maybe it's zero two nine three. Because the seven is the zero and the seven. Oh, oh they do have a similarity six two nine one. Oh, okay. Got it. Got a key. Okay, so it was the same. That's okay. Yeah, it was just the same. 6291 versus 6291 on that side. All right. Well, that's a fucking basement. We're not going... Nobody goes down. You don't go down first. Go up. Fuck, they both go down. All right, we're going down. Well, we're getting, we can't be... Well, doesn't mean a big burly roid rage dude can't be uh, creeping around, right? fuck happened down here? Oh. oh. It's green now. It's Christmas. It's really intense green. Oh. Yeah, that's a ritual, all right. I remember seeing some, uh, some upside down crosses when looking up pictures for the thumbnail. I was wondering what it was. There it is. That's a bad fucking time. Oh, I need this music to calm down. I really need the music to calm down. Uh, there is no. You you are not allowed to control the music. Oh, it's a key. Close that behind me. I am sorry, child. But you have been chosen. Why is there no subtitles? Only the will of God Almighty can rid the world of the horror within. He has spoken to me. I am the messenger. And you, my dear, you are the vessel. What did he do, by the way? So he definitely did the the, the nails, right? Oh, did he didn't cut her throat though? Did he? Yep, yep, right there. Oh, wire appears to be broken. Got it. Need some uh, wire repair tools. Pick something up. Was it? I don't know what that was. Let's just assume it works. Aha! That's a feature. That's how that works. I don't know if that's how that works. Nice. 
Hey, got another card. Charge out. You found a piece of his bell miller, such as in the church. Okay. Now, here's the unfortunate part. No uh, indicator on where to go next. Again, no inventory screen. Oh shit, it's daytime. Keeps getting rid of my weapons! Damn it! Oh! Prezine, it does that. Okay. Oh! What a fucking spider? It is. Actually, I don't even remember how I got here. Oh, it was Tab. Did the spider go away? Are anomalies just teleporting in? Is that what's happening? So that's where, like, the wander comes around. The wandering around happens if you don't... If you set it to normal. That's kind of garbage. Oh! Spider's making his way toward me. I saw him on the map. Look at him. He's creeping. He's coming toward me. It's a real time map. I'm leaving. This bullshit. The fuck is that? Go in there. No. Just give me a weapon. There it is. Ooh, spider. Ah. Oh, he's trapped. Yes. Oh, no. Bam! Nice! Slow-mo kill! Hurt his percent! Locked him! I don't know what health I have! Sir, please. Wow! Combat's really good. Yep. Combat. Combat's super solid, isn't it? Oh! Really good. What the fuck? The space user HCP visual radar beware the audio waves emitted by the. What the fuck? What happened? Why am I blinded? Is that the result of continuing, or did something hit me in the face with splooge? Super unclear. Okay, this one is saying hospital, so let's go ahead. I'll just follow an order. Again, I'm not... I, I'm not... I'm not super interested in fucking collectible games. I'm not. The tone and atmosphere is, is, is actually kind of... is kind of fun. But yeah, like, the collecting aspect... God, I gotta go all the way up here. Alright, let's start sprinting. Well, either I'll cut to some fun encounters if we encounter them, or I'll just cut to me getting to the hospital. So we'll definitely go for, um, like I said, all the, the, the parts of the card. But if collecting all those collectibles gets us into that one door for an uh, in ending, I'm like, oh, we encountered something. And of course, it's near a graveyard. Oh, it's Spooky Bitch again. Ah, uh, she's cool. Take her out. Oh, the problem is these enemies just be swinging on you. It's hard not to take damage. Like, yeah, give me, like a counter, the counter system would be somewhat nice. Maps can be too big. This doesn't make for a better game. And kudos to anybody who who does it, right? But like, that's another thing for me, yo. Fucking shit. That's fucking cool. See, that's what I'm talking about. That's scary as f I'm leaving. Mom, please come pick me up. Mom! Woo! I can't take! I've turned into Daredevil. It's fine. I've become Daredevil. I don't know why. I'm being chased? What's happening? Why's the music out of control? Calm down. I'm hard on them strings, dog. The only thing that would make this game worse if your guy had shitty cardio. <laughs> I'd be so upset. The music is picking up again. I'm leaving. Something's chasing. I can tell. 
Oh, let me guess. This place is protected. Yep. Put that down. Get in the door. Get in the door. All right. We've arrived at the hospital. So yeah, that's fun. I I, I actually quite enjoyed that. You know what? Maybe that's maybe that's what did it. Maybe that's what's causing. Is that, oh, is that a witch eye? It is. Maybe that's what caused people to actually go through because just because of the <laughs> somewhat actual like being chased by monsters is kind of dope. Why is this chair blocking this? Hmm? What's in there? What's in there? What are you trying to hide? Oh shit! Well. Bullshit better not happen down here. All right. Sarah, please stop writing the security passwords on scraps of paper. This is a blatant and serious security risk. Can't afford another incident, especially with the doctor's more frequent visits. That's the best. No, you, Sarah, you don't stop. You continue, because I'm going to need those. What the fuck? Okay. 7422. What was it for? I didn't pay attention. Seven four twenty two. That's bullshit. That's bullshit. You tried to make me forget that combo, didn't you? Seven four twenty two. Can't fool me. Please tell me it's this one. I mean, here's the thing. I mean, they could make it to where you have to run. Seven four twenty-two from something, for sure. But they're when they take away your weapon. Uh, is Thopin? Destroy this paper. Fuck. T H O P three N. Oh, straight up password. Is that what it is? Okay. I assume that's because I got the actual code there. Always a good time. If you get up and fucking chase me, I'm gonna be pissed. Nah, she looks too... She looks too... Like, mom. Please don't come pick me up. See, it took away my weapon. Oh shit, she is gonna get up. She is. I hope the screen explodes. Fuck it. Show no fear. Show no fear. That bitch got up. Ah! Ah! She's a bike! There's the doors open! I'm leaving! No! She appeared in front of me! That's bullshit! Can't teleport? If I can't teleport, you can't teleport. That's horseshit. I'm leaving. Nope, rope a dope, rope a dope, rope a dope, rope a dope. I don't know if I'm supposed to grab anything. I can't open that! Ah! Oh, I locked myself in the door! Move! What happened to my flashlight? She's beating my ass! Oh, wait. So they did. So they took away my ability to fight. And even though this place is supposed to be protected, it's not. Oh, well, now she's gone. That's fine. I'll take it. What did I get from this, by the way? Other than a heart attack. Hey! What's up? Wandering around now, or am I safe? 
Is she just is she just stuck on that floor? That's bullshit. I'm gonna read this iPad. Taylor, I'm sure you've heard by now, but I'm afraid the situation we've discussed is a reality. So, treat as many residents as possible before 6 p.m. and prepare them for transport. The enforcement reps will be transporting the sick and injured people until 7. But please, Taylor, be out of the city by 8. The gates will close at 8. I have no control over what happens here when they're sealed. Oh, okay. Here we go. It's just a, I, I knew there was a circuit somewhere that I needed to connect. I just wasn't just was not sure where it was. Okay, so we still we can't exit that. I, I double checked downstairs. I don't know what the code seven four twenty two is for. Still, the one girl dipped. She's not she's seemingly not a problem right now. Uh, what was a door that I couldn't open? That one. Out of the city by eight. Is that it? she do that because she didn't make it? Taylor, the doctor will be visiting you today to ensure you are implementing his latest regenerative brain treatment correctly. Be sure to accommodate him entirely. That's horse shit. See, if my keyboard was interacting with this, it'd be dope, but it's not. Oh, that's what it was. Got it. Lift the lock down. Although this is probably a bad idea because I'm going to let out what's her name. Yep. That's not good. I just let her out. I, uh, I cannot sprint. Interesting. It's pushing me. really do much. She's angry. She's angry. I'm just gonna go back in the door. I'm just gonna hang out here. We're gonna have a good time. Well, I also know, I mean, I'm here. I'd like to know what was gonna smash me up against the wall, isn't it? What the fuck? Well, it said classification witch. Kind of anticlimactic. Oh no, she's back. She's angry. I'm gonna pause. Take a pause. So let's check out what. Let's see what that uh, code is to the hospital. Oh, this is saying skill one, teleportation. Need all one hundred doctor to doctor DNA. Skill two, which is radial attack. Need fifty. Which is oh, so it's attacks. Okay. So hopefully we can just get to the end of the game without having to worry about that. Good. Good. That's how it should be. Oh, lady, move. I got codes. I think it's eight five two six. Come on! Fuck off! Piss off, ghost! Trying to enter codes here. 
I got it. I got it. Move. Give it a, give it a thing. I'm here. I, wonder, I gotta read this note. Uh, shoot it like it. It's my favorite from Thor. He's like, piss off, ghost. Rope a dope. Rope a dope. Rope a dope. Move. She's angry. Lady, please. I like how she just. She j oh, I'm out of stamina. She just teleports in front of you. She just teleports. I'm leaving. Come on, please come pick me up. Yes. You stay in there. The place isn't very protected. Make me put away my weapon? That's stupid. What is there? A, is there a barrier? Like, who's determining what I can and can't take in these buildings? That's definitely a school. Look at that shitty playground and what looks like a Pokemon uh, battle arena. Yeah, and that's another thing. Like, okay, sorry. With the, the uh, collecting 100 DNA, getting the teleportation, uh, that feels like you know how annoying it is to traverse the map. But the, but the only reason you traverse the map was to get all those things to make it to where you can traverse the map faster. Indie developers like, hey, just make a just make a good linear experience. Like all the creatures, like that in there, like wandering, like having a small open world. I'm I'm definitely not against. I think it was you know having that's very Silent Hill. Like think of the first uh, Silent uh, Hill game. Same thing. Like they they just left you to wander. I get maybe we were just because games were, were the way they were back then that we were kind of like. Yo, this is dope. Oh my god, wandering around these places. Nowadays, to have a... There are so many open worlds, right? And to have a map is actually kind of, like, detrimental. I think I was meant to go down here. Because every... Because there are quite a few. There are so, so many open world things that... Now they're kind of oversaturated. And some people don't want to wander around. And it could be time, right? Like... Then, you know, when you got other things you want to do, it's like, I want to, you want to play games, you want to have these fun little experiences, but, um, when time, but for anybody who, uh, you know, has a day job or has kids, just has things they want to do in life when you have open world experiences, but then, you know, you can make the argument. It's like, well, this game is just not for you, right? It's like, not unfortunately, but hey, there are some games that you just aren't gonna play anymore because that's the way it is they're just they're not for you which sucks um but you know not every game oh, there's a creeper but uh yeah the idea that uh not every game has to cater to everybody like this is a person who wanted to make a game and probably genuinely wanted like people to explore and it's like if you have the time to explore then cool this would be the game for you if you don't then sorry you're just not gonna be able to play the game so the question is, right, do you appeal to a niche group or do you appeal to more people? And there's no right or wrong. There's no right or wrong to that. It's always just going to be somebody's opinion. Oh, no. It's always going to be somebody's opinion. Okay. So uh, we'll just, we'll just again, same deal. We'll cut to when we get to the, we get to the school. All right, let's see what the school has to offer. Let me guess. This place is protected. Even though that's horse shit. It's definitely not protected. There's probably a ghost in here too. Oh man, a school's even worse. These places are huge. Balls. Oh, that was super fucking good. That's what I'm talking about. opening doors and there's just creepy things standing in the middle of the rooms. Mm. Yo, Dat Cola. Only cola that makes you say mmm, Dat Cola. Oh, shit. Is this act... It is. It's the other side of... Oh, fuck that gun. It's the other side of these doors. Oh, this is super good. This is super good. Come at me, bro. Come at me, bro. He's at me. He came at me. He came at me. I shit my pants. Oh. He came at me a little weird, though. He was like... Why the kitty's room? I understand there's anomalies, but who set this shit up? <gasps> Craig. Craig, let me borrow your microwave. 
Tell Craig I fancy him. How to tell if someone's been tainted, how to keep burners from entering a home, dealing with witches if disturbed, the meaning of life, identifying and reporting, types of anomalies, how to survive being tainted. Interesting. Well, apparently being tainted gives you I echolocation. This morning, there were two of them. The man lost it. I knew he was up to something. I'm evacuating the kids tomorrow morning. I guarantee you this time tomorrow, the mayor will be signing a citywide evacuation order. I am curious about the overall backstory, though. About what is Hanwell like as a, as a area? Why was it set up? Is it literally just a town, and then some doctor moved in, right? Started doing stupid shit, shoving anabolic steroids up little children's assholes. Open door simulator. Is that a witch? I'm hiding in the bathroom. That was good. Shh, I can't see. Okay, we're leaving. Sorry to disturb you. Oh, look at this. He's back. Fucking dog. Come here. Beat his ass. Yeah, that's right. You can't, you can't scare me. Hello, Brett. I've just got word about your evacuation of the children yesterday. I know we haven't always seen eye to eye, but I must commend you Aww. on your incredible foresight. Something... Something is coming. Possibly tonight. There's no advantage to you staying in the city to see this through. The children are safe. Get out while you can. What's happening? Oh, it's just tapping in. I'm going to try to get out tonight. I left caretaker's key in your room on the science wing. I'm certain someone will try to find it during evacuation. Once you have it, keep it with you. I left the caretaker's key in the room. Okay. Oh, the caretaker. Yeah. Put it down. Put it down. Milo. Milo, put it down, Milo. Did I just stub my toe? What happened? What about now? Now can I open this door? Can. Is that that key ring? I don't know what's ha- Oh, come on! It's always a basement! Creeping. They're creeping on me. Uh. You gonna run across my screen? Well, there's some bullshit down here. Well, this place sucks. Oh, I'm definitely gonna have to be rope a doping, aren't I? Actually, do oh, it did unlock. Oh, jeez. Oh, come on. Nope. 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 What's that say? I made my bed. Can I go home now? Never. Why is there a dungeon below the school? This is the worst detention ever. You thought your detention halls were bad? We put a dungeon below our school. Uh, let's give my f flashlight a second to get its faculties back together. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Who's that? Is that the caretaker? Alright. It broke again. There are a few connectors in the broom cupboard up in the hall. I guess if I don't want it. Oh, wait. Hold on. What was that last part? I read, I read too fast and didn't read it at all, technically. Uh, if you don't want anyone getting in here. Got it. Well, I want in here. Boom. Can you take it afterwards? No. Oh, shit. What's the code? Oh, man. Did I see a code anywhere? Oh. Um, 
Did I get a code? Okay, so the code should be 5437. I don't know where you find that. That's fine. I'm not trying to try hard this game. I told you. I already told you. The fuck is that? Got it. You can't touch me now. Or can you? I'd be surprised. What the fuck is this? It's got a little vanity in here. Actually, I'm low-key nervous. Did the caretaker bring kids down here and touch them? Caretaker deserves everything. No, but I think that was Brett. I don't- Oh, no, this is the long corridor. Oh, this is bullshit. Oh. Oh, shit. Bro, when there's a, a fucking lazy boy down here... Oh, shit, it's rotating. <laughs> Let's do it. And what looks to be a two-way mirror, right? Oh yeah, actually we do have to we we've <laughs> I already forgot we encountered Slenderman. Who at some point we're probably gonna have to run away from, right? What are these teachers doing? I also already got the piece, so I don't think I have to stick around here. I could easily probably just leave. I see something in there, though. On it. Oh, no, I had to... Okay. Oh! Oh, my gosh. I didn't even... I don't even know if I saw this. So the code for that would have been... I would have gone around because I thought... I went through there and then got around. I was like, that was the only way to get around through there. No, that's... So I, I would have found it if I had just found my way back here. I could have actually found my way back here. Okay. Yeah, because most likely... Oh, It's right here. Brett, someone's on to us. Yep, I think Brett might be a pedophile. There it is. 5437. Oh, these aren't even two-way mirrors. You can see right through. We got a dinosaur. I'm leaving. Also... Is Brett who who commissioned a dungeon in the school basement? Nope, that's not the way. And who was okay with it? They're like, fuck it, it's a lot of money. If somebody if somebody shuts this door and be pissed off. Thank you. I'm leaving. I'm leaving all these creepy ass. These are exactly the chairs you find in schools. Okay, so I was right about a jail. Um, thank goodness I I actually double checked. Um, the, the little guide that I have up just for safety, um, because it did mention jail, and it's like, that's what I thought, but, um, then I couldn't remember why, yeah, so anyways, um, we found the jail. I still had to, like, look up, and, well, actually, what pisses me off more, check this out, it's right next to the fucking church, why would it... Well, that I won't say that it's like specifically a guide, like follow it verbatim, but it did. It felt it, it had you jumping around different areas. Um, I don't know why you wouldn't just go from the church to here, but that's fine. And we got the horror paintings. Good times. We'll go to a bag of what? Nachos. I need a fresh inmate transferred as soon as possible. 24601 has decided to leave us and will be transferred back to the jail by morning. Okay. He almost sounds like Dr. Hugo Strange from Arkham. And that might be what they're going for. Why would the, why would the door open towards you? That's stupid. Thought of this. She need to be fired. Wow. I will be visiting the jail today to ensure the arrest of Director Isabel Miller was carried out as ordered. I shall need to speak with her directly. Does the doctor run this town? <laughs> and well, daily. Council fallen. And we'll compromise. Yes. Some real weird. Real weird shit going on right now. I've been ordered by the doctor to put away the boss only for the mayor to override his authority. What the fuck is happening at the council? And that would explain why there's the council of Hanwell after this. 
I need all available enforcement representatives out looking for the doctor. His authority has been strict. Arrest on site. If necessary, lethal force is authorized. Yeah, this is a, this is a boss arena. Joe, the phone broke. I need to get on. I need to get on to the warden about why we're down here stuck with all this shit falling apart. Let's use upstairs, get a brand new office. Plus, these guys are getting impatient. Half of them haven't even had trial in early. Sounds of hell. Literal sound of hell portal. Oh, always a good time. Hey, buddy. So, is there a few people he did this to? Because obviously it's the same model, right? Stapled mouth shut, but that guy was obviously loose in that dungeon. Oh, look at the darkness. Darkness is spreading in Carol. Oh, hey! It's the Slender Boy again. Come here. Come here. Come in. Looks like he's wearing a backwards cap. Oh, just ignore that. Don't worry about that guy. Just run with the lights off for a while. Good. Yep. Power goes out. Does that mean the cell doors open? Sam, I need you to release Isabel immediately. The doctor's up to something. The allegations he made are false. So what it actually sounds like, it sounds like there's a council. The doctor's on it. A bunch of people are on it. They are obviously probably all a part of doing nefarious shit, but everybody except the doctor was like, this is a bad idea. This is a bad idea. We need to stop. Oh. Oh, that was her. Duh. I didn't even look up. Oh, it's this one. Just... There we go. There's a control room. Oh, it's a bad time. Oh, this is going to be a bad time. Oh no, and then I get to watch this dun oh this dude just walk out of <sighs> Okay, so he's walking away, which is good because I'm gonna be coming from the bottom. The fridge is open again! <laughs> That's the biggest anomaly right there. Oh wait. The shower's working. Oh shit. What the fuck? Where's the Good time? Those wall riders? I'm not scared of your blood. It's like a nightmare on Elm Street. Freddy? Hmm? Let me soak it up. Yeah, check it out. Oh, it's got a hitbox around it, I can't touch it. What? What? Thought I'd be scared of your blood? Oh, I'm scared. Oh, yeah? Hmm? Buddy? I mean, I'd, just, I'd be scared shitless in real life, but nothing's happening. It's fine. I'll just... This too shall pass. <laughs> Oh, 
Is there a shower I can stand at? Done. Okay. Yeah, what I was trying to say was since I unlocked all the doors, this should be unlocked. technically just leave. What? What? There was that one uh, one area with the wall rider. We're just going to call him the wall rider. Because it's definitely a different model. It's definitely. Because it might be those gray dudes I saw. You see, teasing that uh, Slenderman wall rider guy right here. Pretty good tactic. Because now I'm here. Oh, it's a basketball court. He just wants to play some b-ball. That would explain his height. That man was a basketball player, wasn't he? There's nothing in here other than that DNA. Okay, and then uh, I got to figure out what the next place we're supposed to find is. What if he was just standing there? Oh, please. That's bullshit. I said. Oh, I thought that lint. Oh, that, that, that okay, that's good. I'm leaving. Nobody blocked my path. Oh, I'm tired. He's sleeping. He needs some shuggies. He needs some shuggies. You've got to be fucking kidding me. Oh, I wasn't expecting that. Oh, they got me good. Oh, they got me good. I shit my pants. Oh, wait, do I have to... Also, I still had that 2296, and it didn't really do anything. Oh, shit. The door opened in my face. You imagine doing that in real life? That That is some dumb horror shit some horror person main character would do, right? Does that put me? Oh. Put me right after that, then? Except that all of these lights are... I, yeah, I think the game derps out. The game... <laughs> the game can't handle its own restart... phase. It's super weird. Yeah, the game cannot handle its own... res... its own reset. That's... alright, that's fine. Okay! Let's go find the next location. Yeah, Hanwell Power. I'm gonna guess for some reason this building is protected and that doesn't make any sense. Walter, I need you to set up the auto power contingency. At 8 p.m. tonight, the gates will close for the last time. And it's inevitable that residents will be left behind. They'll need the protection of our systems in order to survive long enough for the ministry to mount a rescue if they decide mm. to do so. Interesting. So, are the, uh, obviously, obvious anomalies that are humanoid, are those some of the residents that got left behind and they're, that's like full on tainted or something? Or are those just anomalies and everybody's dead, right? Like, there's no... Oh, we got a story. Walter tells me the plant is running at optimal capacity. Even providing a surplus of power, we can sell back to the Ministry. 
this is a direct result of my research, and still people are questioning my ethics. Yep. That's appropriate. That is a, yep. You should uh, question, question it, question all of it. Usually in buildings, I don't have infinite. Yep, there goes there goes my steam and ass. I can't, I can't jump. Like my guys, he can run for days, but he just he cannot jump. It's too difficult. And there's no indicator. Usually, the, oh, oh no. I tried it with these ones, but I didn't think it was a thing. How would my guy know? to start turning valves. Yeah, these things, hold on. Okay, nope, red. All right, gotta look for red. Obviously, I need to get into here. I don't know why he left a recorder there. There should be a valve here, but there was no indicator leading up to here that I was gonna need valves. Also, valve missing here. Oh my God, how many valves do I need? this is that why that's there no point a light at it all right hey look what I found so they were wander, or they were, they are scattered around places. Hey, so yeah, we got that one, and then we got that one. What is okay? And is it gonna open that up? That's super unclear, though. Like, how would you have? How would this guy have figured out that he needed to do this in the first place? Okay. I knew it. I knew it. Now I gotta turn it off. Hold on. Now there's too much pressure. It's too hot. How do I get in there? Pick this up. You'd think you'd just undo it. There we go. Okay. That prompt didn't pop up immediately, so that's what I was thinking. Like, oh, sh okay. Just had to give it a second. Okay, that was really weird timing because the icon distracted me for, for my flashlight. I saw the icon pop up, I looked over and then saw something, you know, creep across my screen. Oh, that's also the dude. So yeah, thinking about it, by the way, we aren't like our dude. Hold on, stand up. Or dude, oh my God, we're actually... We are, we are a lady. Yeah, it looks like a small chest. And some of the thumb, whoa, thumbnails, uh, I looked up online, I saw that guy. Also, wasn't this place protected? How did he bring in a wrench? Interesting. Sit your ass down. Sit, sit your ass down. Hiding in all them bodies. Crispy boys. Get your crispy body out of here. I gotta go stick. Oh, I can't get the glow stick. I gotta keep. Did that just opened up. It did. Huh, interesting. So, who is this? Oh, is that. Uh, wait. Did they say Miller? Whoever the power plant dude is, I guess. Also, I came all around here just to also get this which hey you know what i appreciate that means i have the ability to defend myself now so they can throw some they can throw some bitches at me i ain't too I ain't too worried hey Oh, jeez. Get I care. Stop swinging at me. Ah. Beat its ass. Hell yeah, let's go. Ooh. 
Oh, it's already unlocked. Get it. Beat it, says. Hell yeah, get out of here. Honk. Stop opening up doors toward you, dog. You know what I'm saying? Now, unless a, uh, all right. I'm saying, unless a door slams in front of me. I win. Now what? I got a wrench. I found this. This is mine now. Okay, we are nearing what I assume is the exit. Animal Council. Oh! Okay, because I saw some I saw some codes for council. And yeah, we were looking for that earlier. So this this is the council. Got it, got it, got it, got it. And again, probably why there's uh, the Council of Hanwell after this. You have gained access to the council. Oh shit. It's a fucking door. Um Lero. Yeah, I'm curious. I am curious what Hanwell was, if it was just a town. What was the purpose? Or if it's it's Silent Hill inspired. I mean, you got the fog, but that's an easy way to make a game scarier, right? It's to obscure your vision. You got the wandering, but... Um... But... I don't know. Is it a... Uh, yeah, what's the purpose of the town itself? All councillors must be present in the chamber today to ensure the swift passing of Hanwell's new visitor legislation. We're under increased pressure from the public after the Littlewood incident. Any about 90% of the systems are down, so expect to see a few of these laying around. They're saying it was the doctor. Apparently, he shut down the city's third level security system. It's back online now, but it looks like the damage has been done. I'm out, Jay. Oh, no. So, possibly, despite this being a, a fortress stronghold, some shit still happened. Well, he, his DNA there. I need everybody involved in the recreation construction project across the city to be in meeting room two at 10 a.m. The Ministry are happy with its progress, but they need reminding of its necessity in a lockdown city such as Hanwell. And we got the Ministry, which is not a good sign or word or term. Look at that big ass security card! Holy balls. Barlow, I need you to visit the jail immediately and secure the release of Isabel Miller. I sent a message, but I'm afraid it may not be heard in time. Do not trust the doctor. I'm currently in the process of having his authority stripped. You. You're one of them, aren't you? Yes. I can see the resemblance. Ooh, much younger. Fascinating. I don't suppose you inherited his self-inflicted abilities, though, did you? You have no idea, do you? I mean, I mean, I can Z. Am I the doctor? No. So we have somebody. And I kind of wondered, like, yeah, why were we in the thing? Am I an anomaly, technically, but just in, like, human form? Did he succeed in something? Like, the ritual? That's it, very unclear. There's a server room. Pull the hard drives. Has anyone else wondered why we just call him the doctor? Yeah, yeah. I actually can't remember if I made the comment about, um, that's where discovered. Uh, when you don't call somebody by a name, how can you keep forgetting his crazy is as long as no one? As long as you know the first four numbers of the two times table, I'll give you a clue the first ones to, oh, two, I don't. Wait. It's just too tight. Like, what? I've had reports from concerned parents that Brett Chambers has been doing some unspeakable things with his students at HHS. These are unsubstantiated, of course, but need to be taken seriously. Could you contact Miller and have her deal with this? Mm -hmm. Just touching kids. I know it. Built a dungeon. 
mean, the combination to the safe. I just keep forgetting it since we're only here one more night. Oh, that's the tank. Mm. Two times. That worked. I got it. I win. Yeah, because the only instance of when they say two times table, you're like, like, literally, like just two times one, two times two, two times three, two times four. <laughs> all right, that's a that's a hell of a way to. That's all right. That's I, I can see that. Yo, y'all got research in here? What kind of research you got in here? Yeah, I did wonder that from the beginning. If if we were an anomaly ourselves of some kind. Oh, Doctor, he's here. He's here. He's here. The one you've been looking for so frantically is right here. Just waltzed into the council. Password discovered. We are on high alert. All councillors must be present during the final statement of evacuation. All essential council staff must remain at their post until 7 p.m. At which time, I urge you all to leave the city. Shelters have been set up outside the walls to keep your family members safe while they await your arrival. Uh, some of these don't have uh, subtitles. I have made it past phase two by just seemingly wandering through places, not even like... I'm not even having to fight anything, which I'm not against. I have no weapon. That's what I was hoping would happen. Ooh, that was super close. It's the Resident Evil laser hallway. Nice. All right. Your defenses are weak. Where the fuck did that thing come from? Thin air. The doctor doesn't know. Well, he, he doesn't speak to me. He must be bitter knowing he can't touch me. Or, or maybe he's trying to punish me. I didn't agree with his dystopian view of the city I ruled so benevolently for so many years. <laughs> Look at me telling you about the doctor. Oh, you should know more about him than anyone, surely. After all, you're his only success since the fall. Yeah, I like that. I do like those as twists, like you're playing as <clears throat> the thing. He's managed to retain 99% of his DNA with you. Oh, I guess the 1% he lost was the bit that makes you talk. You're far too quiet. No, 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 I don't like you. Okay. situation. Only I can see the importance of my research. So it stands to reason that I alone can succeed myself. I like how one, one baddie, one baddie made it and they were thwarted by lasers. Well, yeah. if you can find him, I'm sure he's desperate to meet you. Oh, is that mayor? That's the uh, yeah. Just, just run into the laser beams, or like grab her, <laughs> stick her hand. Can beat like that's not. It's not difficult. The cloning process was initially rocky. However, I did manage to maintain 99% of my DNA within C3. Unfortunately, he died within a week. Respiratory failure. No matter. Respiratory? The infusion of anomalous DNA with my own negates the need for a successor clone. Res respiratory? Respiratory? Okay, so we're a clone. I don't know the password. Well, how the fuck do I figure this out? Okay, still not 100% sure. I, I went ahead and just looked it up. But I'm... I, 
I genuinely tried to look around to figure it out, but now I'm wondering, like, uh, the mayor said something. I didn't hear what she said. I heard her, I thought she, yeah, and I, I wasn't gonna like check back the recorder, but like she started talking and I didn't quite catch everything she said because it happened so fast. Maybe she actually said it, I don't know. And then there's the doctor's terminal password. So I don't know how 2296, I don't know how you get 2296 from any of that. Oh. Oh. Did that happen as soon as I let down the lasers or while I was in here? Oh, goodness. Okay. She exploded. Oh. That's really good. There's no chance I'm getting out. There never was. I hope that you will try and convince the Ministry to mount a rescue. Not for me, but for the sake of the residents. I won't hold my breath on their decision. I know you'll never hear this, but it will help me come to terms with my situation. Closure, so to speak. Oh, yeah, and it doesn't you just walk right through them. Okay, and then we have the password. That's super dope. And you can only wonder, like, what what did they do to her? She just exploded. But there's no bits of her. There's just blood. The whole cloning thing, though, it's like, I mean, is the idea, potentially, potentially, that if he dies, something will continue his work, but, like, a clone is not inherently you. It's 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 your DNA, but it doesn't necessarily mean it will have your exact way of thinking, right? Unless you convince it. I thought like maybe we were gonna be like his assistant or something, but <gasps> there he is. Yeah, okay. It it is just that model. Well, what I'm referring, what I was referring to as Wall Rider. No, definitely not even close to Wall Rider. The gray man. There's aliens. Let them all out. Actually, no. There's. I don't think there's any reason to let these things out because uh, they're actively a danger to everything. So it's not like you get over on somebody, you know, like the classic. There's a burner. Yeah, I, I would appreciate more like. I mean, I only encountered... That's bullshit. I'm tired. I'm sleepy. I'm EPs. What the fuck? This is dumb. Yeah, turn on your fucking shirt. Sure. So climactic. Fuck off! Burner! Leave me alone! Damn! I don't even have a weapon! Check out this climax right here. He's over here. Let me open the door. Get off of me! Are you shitting me? Are you... F Bro, this is fucking terrible. You should have never had that. Oh, now I get to kill the doctor. How? Am I supposed to have a weapon? What the fuck is going on? It kind of failed the ending here. Because I can't tell if I'm supposed to have a weapon or not. Bro, are you f This is terrible. Is this working? I can't tell. Mine. You're so 
Fuck off! Piss off, ghost! Gosh. This is super unclear. It's fine. I can't see! Bro, I didn't ask for this. Nothing's changed. Just like Adam Jensen. Nobody asked for this. What are you talking about? I- you have no right to exist without my blessing. That's actively not how that works. Oh my god. Oh, there he is. That's fine. Nope, that's- that's- Fucking ghost bitch. Oh my god. Pretty sure. Oh my god, I just ran out of stamina. Okay, I think he's done. He has no. Oh no, apparently he kind of has some ability. Are you sh fucking shitting me? Oh my god. Oh! Fuck off! Holy shit. Oh my goodness, I think we did it. That was terrible. That was, like, an indie game or not. Wow, you have to, like... You've got to figure out a better ending. Like, holy shit. Or a better combat something. Instead of a big-ass open-world map. Ethan Seed House. That's what I was getting at. Some of the spookiness, cool. Combat system, obviously, like, yeah, you're not a military personnel. Story, obviously a mystery still. Okay, we're a clone. Still not clear on what his, like, overall goal was. All in all, flush out a story. Stick to a much more linear gameplay mechanic. Oh, And... Like, all the, the buildings that we went to, like, cater to them. Make it to where you can really flush out story, put in, make it feel a little bit more lived in. Like, yeah, to me, when you, when you take time to make a map and you put in a number of buildings you actually can't explore, that feels a little bit like a waste of time as opposed to really flushing out areas better. I would make my first game and the second game like super linear and focus on the mechanics and the spooks and the scares and the world building. And then by like, see this whole like beyond handwell thing that we'll get into, that feels like that would be your open world opportunity once you've kind of done this. And it says go back. So no, we're not, I don't know what we'd go back for. So we can't go back here or into the council. Which it doesn't feel like there's anything else to explore there anyways. Okay. Is she just there or is that just coincidence? Oh my god, this fucking bitch. Also, the door's super closed. F piss off, ghost! Like, for real? Or is that supposed to- oh no wait. Oh, I got tainted again. Oh my god. I just- I just want to double check. I just want to... Like, was that complete coincidence? Well, this game always has a hard time, uh, handling its own restarts, so let's find out. You know, the lights are on now. Yep, so doors open. I think this is literally just to go back and explore Hanwell. Give me that. Is that a cricket bat? Cricket, cricket bat, bat. Yeah. So, dude is just here in Hanwell, I guess. Okay. Yo, hello again. So I'm putting this video at the end uh, because apparently I just suck at critiquing video games after playing them. Um, so I got some notes up here, um, but that is the end of the gameplay, but I want to give a better criticism. Um, so if you don't care about that, you can stop here and move on. But for anyone who does care about some criticism, here's a couple things I liked. Um, I did like the atmosphere and some uh, scary spooks, uh, like the cloud, the cloud, when that cloud actually kind of popped up and I was like, what the fuck is that? That was, that was actually kind of dope. It'd kind of be dope if the cloud kind of like 
was the stalker of the whole open world. Um, and I did get, I did, did actually get startled a couple times. Um, and then of course the world building and the mystery that was all really well done. But for the critiques, the main main negatives for me, I said it before, and I'll reiterate. If you didn't do an open world and maybe instead had like a facility that was the doctor's facility, like he had a whole place that like he did his experiments that you worked your way out of that leads to Handwell, that could be better, right? And that's what I meant by like, I would work in reverse. The first couple games I would make super linear, like Outlast. Outlast is actually the perfect inspiration that maybe they took already from, but it doesn't, it, if they did, it doesn't feel like that. Do a linear game. And then when you've got the experience in developing some more, then go mini open world, right? Like you escape the doctor's place, um, where he was doing all of his experiments. And then you, uh, and, and then he tries to stop you from escaping. And then you escape into Hanwell, which has gone to shit. That would be a better progression, very linear, as opposed to starting with open world. Doing open world for the sake of open world is not good. The Steam page does say dense world. It's objectively not. Um, if you're going to do open world, you definitely need to cater to the open world. Um, the monsters are clunky and you can just run past all of them. I think, I think I thought you couldn't get past the smoke or like he would always touch you, but I think I encountered him. No, no, I don't think I did. I thought I encountered him one more time um, at some point and was still able to outrun him, maybe. Um, but because of the mechanics and the gameplay, uh, fight mechanics, uh, enemy animation, stuff like that, like you're not catering to the open world aspect, which is why it also is kind of the negative aspect, ironically. Um, and I cited this, like how much, I don't know how much more plot I can get that's worth it by wandering around a town and finding out that most of the buildings can't be entered anyway, and there isn't much more story to be gained. Um, I felt you could definitely gain, again, if you stayed at, if you were in a facility that was the doctors, you could really elaborate on what the doctor was trying to do. And then all the people who had problems with him, you could hear maybe voiceover recordings of him of be, being, you know, shit on basically by the other council members. And then his reaction, you, you just, that would be such a better, such a better focus. I'd also feel super let down if I scoured everything, like all the buildings and all that stuff, because it's a decent sized map and didn't get anything more out of it. The collectibles, which in the council of, Han um, I did notice this. Yeah. So the collectibles, uh, which in the council of Hanwell, I did see, cause I booted it up. Um, they did cut the DNA down to like 50 and then completely eliminated the witch eyes, but a world filled with collectibles does not add to the density. And when one of them is to teleport around after you've already walked around that large of a map, that is an a, objectively a terrible idea. The, in terms of like story, uh, the clone thing didn't really get closure as far as I can tell. Um, and again, the overall doctor's plot with the anomalies, like I, I still super unclear. Like, I don't know if those are just, they were opening portals, like, like half-life, like Zen, um, it, w some kind of experiments, you know, outlast is our experiments specifically. Um, but they're done at a, like a psych psychiatric ward. Right. <clears throat> um, and then Hanwell, I don't know what Hanwell is like. Silent Hill is just a small town that some people did some like ritual shit in and it fucked it up. But Hanwell is seemingly just walled off and secluded in the first place before the lockdown. They, they had a wall around that place. Um, so I don't know if it's just a testing ground. Um, and if that's the case, like why do they have people living there? Um, it makes it seem like it's just like they make it seem like it's just a self-sufficient town, but why would the council want experiments? Um, because they obviously do go out of their way to evacuate people like they do care about the citizens and the kids and stuff. So I just want to wrap this video up with a better critique. Some of the things I liked, but uh, the, the main, what I feel negative around making an open world game. So that is going to be it for welcome to Hanwell. We will not be going into council, <laughs> but we will be going into beyond Hanwell, which from the look of 
I think they're leaning more into that linear gameplay. Um, but who knows? We'll see. So thank you for joining me for this, and I will see you in Beyond. Doses.